it's super easy to lead them, and thank God they never learned how to lead you. If if Notch ever programs that into their AI, I will flip my shit, because they will be hellishly difficult to kill. Well, no, they'll still be easy to kill, I bet, but they'll just be a pain in the ass to dodge, which is not quite the same thing. Oh, I missed. Oh, well. I missed again. Whatever. You know what? All of this crap here, if it gets blown up, I'm just going to replace it with cobblestone anyway, so I don't care. And now we got a taint wall right here. Oh, and it's never going to get hit because it's covered by taint. That's glorious. Never fear. Okay. Almost done here. How much... I got three full rows of this stuff left. Three columns, I mean. Alright. So we got plenty of cobblestone. I think we're going to make it all the way through. And once we have this, derp, first mistake, epic pain. How embarrassing. I got like this dirt thing sticking out of my... Looks like one of those... What are those things called? From back in the those cartoons that were like rip-offs of the Smurfs and they were like under the sea. But they were basically Smurfs. Like aquatic Smurfs. And they had like little weird doodads on their heads. I can't remember what they were called. There was like snorgles or something like that. I couldn't even begin to remember. They were dumb though. I mean, I liked the Smurfs when I was a kid. I, I was like five, and I knew those were a ripoff, complete ripoff of the Smurfs. It was shameful. Okay, this is the part where I need to go around. Put those there. Put that there. Put that there. Down there and there. All right. Shelter from the storm here. All right. We are doing kick-ass. fast way this time. Hmm. Missed. Okay. And I think that's it. That's the entire tunnel. Is linking these two together and we're done. This is a long stretch? Not really. It'll still take me a while, but damn it. Second mistake third if you count both as two, but then you're a jerk. Alright. No, I ran out of another column. Sad day. Actually, oh no! Failure number four, slash three. Five. Ah, it's because I'm, I'm getting impatient. Because I'm like right here. I'm done. Okay. Um, go ahead and throw a minecart on the tracks. Let's get the hell out of here. Whee! Alright, so now I have a uh, train tunnel that goes all the way back to my house and never is once exposed to the outside nether, which is awesome, because now I don't have to uh, worry about that crap. This should be good. Alright, so, um, I've got a train dealy doodad bobber now, and uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try out my hoe of the mystic on this, on this farm and see what it does, because I'm sure it does something, I think. That sounded really confident. I'm sure it does something, maybe. I'm absolutely positive. Ish. Can you auto plant when you? Whoa! It's a thing of magic and wonder and wonder magic. Holy crap! It's glorious. It's the greatest. It's better than anything I have ever seen. Oh my god, that's awesome! 
and uh, it takes forever to repair. Holy crap. It almost broke, but it didn't. It had like just a little bit left and it was just perfect. Oh man, this is going to be epic. It's like the perfect size for my growing room. Here, you can have your cobblestone back. I don't need it. Alright. I have the rest of this stuff too. Okay. Now, I don't really need the seeds, and I don't really need, um. <clears throat> I don't really need the wheat either. Uh, but. I was wanting to see if it would allow me to replant as well. No such luck, huh? I'm right clicking. I don't know if it's doing anything or not. Well, um, I guess you have to replant by hand, but that's okay, because, I mean, look how much friggin' progress that was. That was amazing. Like, instantaneously, but it, it took like a quarter of my, uh, my torch's bar with that insanity. That was awesome. Crazy. I've never seen anything that cool in my life. Well, I don't know. I had the, the Harvest Goddess Band's pretty friggin' wicked, but since I don't have one of those, the Mystic is definitely a strong candidate for a tie. That is freaking awesome. And, uh, yeah. I am impressed. I really like his whole swooshy swoosh breaking routines. I think they're cool. I think he should steal the uh, Dark Matter pickaxe power for the Axe of the Core and make it uh, mine an entire vein instead of instead of smelting. Because the entire vein thing makes a lot of sense with the, the rest of his tools doing what they do. And it would just be awesome if... if it broke an entire vein instead of... smelting, because if you smelt stuff, you know, then you don't get a chance to, I've already gone over this, but you don't get a chance to, um, smelt it in your, your arcane furnaces, which are badass. I mean, I got, like, at least a third of, you know, my ore as a bonus, if not, like, 50%, which is kick-ass, since I'm not using IC2 because it's broken. Um, IC2 is broken. Anybody that says otherwise is just nostalgic. There was a time when IC2 wasn't broken. It was back when IC2 was the only tech mod worth using. Now there's a few. And I really just... To be honest, uh, the only thing that I really think is broken in IC2 is the Macerator. Everything else I'm cool with, but... Anything that completely distorts vanilla Minecraft mechanics and has absolutely no respect for other mods which may rely on a balancing element there, uh, like uh, Equivalent Exchange being the prime example that I'm using, um, you know, that's just aggressive, and it doesn't really say, I want to balance with other mods. It says, other mods can go fuck themselves, which is basically how I perceive the Mace Raider's balance. And amazingly enough, Player is the one who did it, and Player's an Equivalent Exchange fan, so I don't understand how he could pull something off like that. I'm sure he never plays without IC2, and I don't think that he's an anti-balance kind of guy. So I don't know what he was thinking when he did it, but whatever, that's his prerogative. I can dig it, I guess. So let's see what we got going on um, on the on the cool. We've got uh, we got a lot of seeds now, um, and fortunately these can be used for something eventually. Um, I guess I'll have to get rid of them some way, somehow. But uh, yeah. So, um, let's see, taking a look at what I got here. I got a ton of wheat. Oh, jeez. I mean, it's good and everything, but just look how much of it. It's fucking absurd. What is 9 times 64? Well, it's 8 times 64, so it's 512? That's a lot. 512 wheat's enough to make, um, 60. Oh, I don't know. It's math. Do I know math? It's, um, 51 divided by 3 is 17, yeah, 
17... What was I doing again? 170 pieces of bread. So I can get two and a half stacks out of that. 170 pieces of bread. Very nice. Uh, what was I doing with my brain? Uh, I guess I was taking a uh, recording break. I will go ahead and take a recording break now that I've done so much awesome crap today, and uh, I'll smoke a cigarette and maybe go out and get drunk. I don't know. Um, but I will see you guys in the next episode. I'm going to go ahead and encode tonight, so I'll stop here for the evening. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next upload frenzy. See y'all later.